All right. This one is a Datex Omida Aspire View. Um, it's a little bit more uh, vintage machine. <clears throat> so, as usual, we have the cables, air, oxygen, vacuum, scavenger, going in the ventilator here, we have the oxygen backup, All right, and then we have our usual components. We have our anesthetic gas, we have our oxygen, external, we have our vacuum, and that's the vacuum chamber down here. <clears throat> Same as usual. The switch is here. And and those are the flow meters. Oxygen and air. Okay, there's the usual bag ventilator switch. APL valve. So again, uh, air and oxygen come from there. Circuit pumped in the bellow, go to the patient, here, back to the machine, back to the circuit, and off you go. All right, regarding the ventilation modalities here, um, you have to press this button and select your ventilation modes. Here you have volume control, pressure control, SIMV, PSV Pro, SIMV PC, pressure control. Anyway, what you really gonna need here is either volume control or PSV Pro. This is the pressure support ventilation in this machine. So if the patient needs, uh, if the patient needs control volume, uh, volume controlled ventilation. So we're just gonna put them on this mode. Select the volume, the tidal volume that you want. The rate, inspiration, expiration ratio, the maximum pressure achieved, 40, it's a good safety. Peep, all right. And there you go. Then you come back here and you turn the machine from bag to ventilation mode. Now here is telling me that it's unable to drive the bellow because I didn't turn on the, f the gas here. Okay, the first thing obviously is to open the gas so that the air flows from there, from the wall, into the machine and uh, passes through the flow meters and then into the circuit. So I obviously have to turn this on to have a flow of air and gas. So now that I have opened the, the flow, you see the bellow here starts to fill up. There you go. And now, now the machine is working, so it's delivering tidal volumes and here I have attached the bag so you can see that it delivers tidal volumes all right so that's the ventilation mode as I said before you will be given instructions on the different uh, settings that we will require to ventilate um, patients in ARDS type of picture if you want to set the PSV Pro mode, go back here. Ventilation mode, PSV Pro. 
pressure support, it asks immediately which pressure support you want. Let's say 10. And here you have your backup as we've seen before. So that's the backup rate and the backup uh, pressure. So let's say the patient is not triggering because there is no patient here. So after a little while, you will see that it will start with the backup mode. It's usually 30 seconds. There you go. And the backup mode is active now with these settings. Okay. So here, um, if the patient then is making efforts, let's say I'm moving the bag here, you see that the machine delivers an amount of pressure every time the patient tries to breathe. Well, well, theoretically, I should actually expand it, but I can't really do it with one hand. So here, whenever I move the bag, there is a sensor here that senses the, the change of flow. And so, um, so it, it senses that the patient is trying to breathe and then it delivers a breath, okay? So I turned it back to spontaneous mode here just to show you that's, that's again the same story. Spontaneous mode, oh, sorry. Um, this is uh, bag mode, this is the bag and I just bag the patient manually. All right, so there you have it. That's the Datex Omega Aspire View. All right, thanks, see you later.